happening guys it's your boy asg15 and today we've got another 2025 canes franchise game to go through today today we'll be traveling to philadelphia to take on the flyers just to adjust to uh, discuss the mini elephant here in the room as you can see through the matchup stats in the blues and senators game some of the scores are a little bit off and we'll get to the reason why but to go through the stats we are still 14, 3, and 1. First on goals 4 per game and against per game. Ninth on the power play. Eighth on the kill. Here's your division leaders. Here are our team point leaders. And here's your league leaders. So the reason that we, I, that I, we did this franchise to get us back to this point was that we now finally have real coaches in the game. Featuring this beautiful coach, Mr. Rod Brendamore. With a total record of 292, 133, and 45. With a 66.9% win percentage. So let's go ahead and jump right on into the game. It will be Kochetkov versus Erson in net. So let's go ahead and jump right on into it. And as always, let's go Canes. Whistle blows, stopping the play. Slavin's getting two 
advantage. The Flyers played along the boards. Quick shot! Stopped by the goaltender. That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice and make himself as big as possible. Tries to feed it over to Konechny. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Hammers him in the open ice! Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. Moves into the slot. Oh, it's Stato! It's Stato! What a save! Well, that's all Will, and this is going to elevate his team, no question about it, James. I mean, it was all but in him, and he comes from nowhere to make that save. Passes on over to Forster. And that's put away by Frost. Close save! Carolina's got it in their own zone. The Flyers gain possession. Quick pass to Frost. Great reach with the puck check. Rocks him on the play. Ajo's got it along the boards. Quick feed to Lawton. Forster's got it in the defensive end. The Flyers pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Nice poke check. Slavin standing up, ready to go. Carolina's PK unit comes up clutch. James, the PK was a specialty team that I actually played on, and a good aggressive habits there, and it leads to the kill. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the game is still scoreless. Puck scooped up by Johnson. Great read as he crouches down to block it. Pass across to Johnson from the neutral zone now. Here's a short pass to Burns. Right in the open ice, that one's picked off. And that's picked off by Stahl. Scooped up along the wall by Slavin. And he passes it up ahead to Martinick. The Hurricanes play the puck from the back of the net. One time shot. And that won't go as it trying to shake the defender. He's in. All alone. Oh, and I think he got confused what he was going to do there. You can see him looking at the goaltender, whether he's going to shoot or deke. And while he's thinking, he's running out of real estate. Tries to get the puck over to Perry. Tremendous hit into the boards, and that's a finishing play. Sends it out in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Huge steal in his own end. Goes right to the crease.
The Hurricanes take it from the side. Oh, and he whiffs. Picked off by Frost. Carolina's got a hold of the puck. And somehow he hangs on. Slides the puck across to tip it. Great reach with the poke check. Trying to gain a stop. All alone. He scores! What a shot! You get these great A scoring chances nice and tight to the net. You got to find a way to convert on it, but you have to be aware of where the goaltender is. You don't have much time, you have to have quick hands, but you have to find the back of the net when there's not much room. And now it's grabbed by Ristolainen. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Forster. And it's a quick pass to Blake. And the rookie, he's hunting down his first goal. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. Handles the puck. Oh, and he throws a perfectly executed hip check there. A chance in front! Great save from in tight. Costas Bears moving the puck through his own zone. Puts it in deep. The Flyers gain control of the puck. Delorier is carrying it ahead. And he dodges the puck check there. Puck sent over to Carrier. Hard hit frees up the puck. Puck grab by York. And he takes the pass. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Knocked off the puck. Oh, and he misfires on that. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Feeds it on over to Konechny. Shot! There's a great close save by Kuchnikov! Now a quick pass to Svechnikov. Shakes off the coverage. All alone! Score! tonight.
are just moments away from the start of period number two. A one-sided affair thus far. Let's see if anything changes here with the start of the second. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. The Hurricanes dominated that opening frame, James. I mean, they held the majority of possession, and the underlying metrics would say they were in complete control of the game, and so does the scoreboard. And that goes off a body. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Keeps possession. Puck set across the blue line. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Picked up along the boards by Svechnikov. Ajo's got it in the offensive zone. Takes the shot. Oh, and he denies him on the one-timer. Wow. Only to look in. That's an incredible sequence of saves. He is so dialed in. But I got to say, where are the D-boxing out? Lots of time left in this period, and the ice has been tilted to this point. 3-0 is where we sit right now. Puck picked up by Zabula. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Feeds the puck up to Lawton. Lead pass ahead. Score! on face-off. Can't connect good use of the body on that play. Nietzsche's moves the puck to the corner. And that's blocked. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Pass back to the point. Taken by Lawton. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Zamola. And he serves it across to Lawton. Great hit on the play. The Flyers gain the zone. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Here he is on a breakaway. Big time save. He was dialed in there. Well, he has the benefit of seeing it coming here, James. So he gets himself set to position he anticipates. I think he has a book on the shooter to be truthful. And he makes a save. Carolina's got control of it now from their own end. Here we go. Puck's in deep. Philadelphia's got the puck. Taken along the wall by Paling. Ristolainen's. It's a two-on-one. Digging in defensively to stop that rush. Carolina's gained possession. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Denies them in front. He got all of that hit. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Gostas Bear. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck against the wall. Bray Green comes up with it. Oh, the outside of the post and stays out. Philadelphia's been working hard, and they're still in the game here. Yes, they hit the pipe and it went out. But they're still in the game. They have to fight right to the end. Moves with the puck at the corner. And he keeps possession. Let's go! and his confidence is just showing every time he shoots the puck.
The Hurricanes take possession here inside the offensive zone. Knocked away with the stick by Burns. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Slides the puck ahead to Johnson. Receives the pass. Angles it over to Konechny. Moves the puck. Cutting to the front of the net. Jostled off the puck. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Kachikov. Passes it over. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Faraby. Stoppage and play offside the call. Past the halfway mark of this period, and it's been a pretty one-sided affair to this point. It's 4-1. Ajo's won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Feeds it over. And that carries off one of his teammates in front. Shuts him down. And he moves it up to Jarvis. Along the half wall with the puck. Unloads the shot. Big save by the goaltender once again. Scooped up along the wall by Lawton. Moves it to Ristolainen. Big play inside the defensive zone. Makes the save. Slides it diagonally to Frost. at the point. Handles that one. We're going to face off after the puck stays covered up. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. Philadelphia is going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Here he is with the backhander. Oh, he got paddled by Kuchikov. What a save. I mean, how quick do you have to be to be able to get on that puck, James. Anytime it's in the low slot, you've got to be on your toes, and that's exactly what he was to be able to make the save. Dishes it off. Quick pass to Martinick. And that slides right out to center ice. Oh, and some smooth skating to lose a defender there. Burns has the puck against the half wall. Got a little too much air on that bomb. Well, I like the intensity of the shot from the blue line, James, but very rarely are you going to beat a star goaltender shooting from there, so you got to find a way to keep it low, try and get some traffic, have a seeing eye shot. Quick feed to Hathaway, and that's knocked away by Walker. Grabs it in his own end. Blake's got the puck. Carolina's got it from behind the net. Forces the turnover. Back at the point, he set it up. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow! Cuts into the paint! Oh, what a great save by Kachetkov! What an incredible glove save by the goaltender. I mean, he gets out to the top of his crease. He's challenging. He's saying, hey, try and beat me on this side. And he keeps that one out. Second intermission approaching quickly here. And he hangs on to the puck. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Works it across to Walker. Slavin's taking the puck behind his net. Well, there you go. We played 40 minutes. Final chance for the coaches to push their messages home. And we'll see the third period coming up in just a matter of moments. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. 
Two-thirds of the way to the finish line in this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? The Flyers, Coach, won't be happy with their performance tonight and the effort areas and the habits. I mean, they really haven't been hard on the puck. They haven't been strong or physical. And as a result, their opponent has taken it to them because they've had the puck the entire game. The Hurricanes will play it from the defensive zone. Puck scooped up by Ajo. What a steal in his own end. The Hurricanes get a hold of it. Oh, what a hip check of the old school variety. Beautiful. Carolina's on the attack. And he slides it quickly to Slavin. Philadelphia's got the puck in their own end. Here's a short pass to Couturier. Oh, what a move. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Oh, my goodness. It stayed out. What a save. It was all those saves. Philadelphia is moving it up the ice. Oh, save. And that one's picked off. Oh, and a miss fires. That goes right out of the zone. Picked up along the wall by Frost. Tippett's taking it from his own end. Quick pass across to Frost. Comes up with a monster save in front. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the three square of the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Trying to gain a step. Takes it across the blue line. Oh, spectacular save to shut down the rock. It's on, let's go. Puck dumped in, and the forwards will head off. Philadelphia's got possession of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Chance. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Walker. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Good solid check, and he loses control of it. Moves it to Ristolainen. Passes the puck over to Hathaway. Gains the zone through center. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Slides it over with pace to Roslovic. Got it along the wall. And the puck leaves the zone. The Hurricanes have it now. Through center. Quick feed to Orloff. Sends it into the offensive zone. Quick pass to York. Tries to get the puck to Forster. And that's offside, stopping the play. Still lots of time left in the period. Carolina's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. Philadelphia's going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that face-off. Drives to the sweet spot. Oh, one of his teammates was right in the shooting lane there. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. Here's a short pass to Walker. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. The Flyers need to find a way to break on through here. They've had plenty of shots on net, but they've got to convert here in order to even things up. Stalls won the draw, and they're on the attack. Oh, that goes just wide of the net. I think he had more time than he thought here, James, with the pressure coming in on him. He just releases the puck quick, and he misses wide. Picked up along the boards by Konechny. Shakes off the defender with some nifty moves. Just wide. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. And now it's grabbed by Couturier. Broken up by Walker. With some open space here in the neutral zone. Oh, great move to sidestep the check. With the stop. Puck is frozen and we get a stoppage in play. The Blackhawks roll into town next on this homestand. And this should be a fascinating matchup the way these two teams line up against each other. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. With the steal. To the front. And he decides to backtrack on a good-looking opportunity. 
Hammers the pass at center. Turns up and away. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Oh, and another big stop. The Hurricanes have blown their opponent right out of the water tonight. They've outmatched them in every area and facet of the ice. And now it's over to Lawton. Toss it up in the neutral zone. Philadelphia's got the puck here in the open ice. Grabbed along the board by Zamula. He got all of that one. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Oh, and he delivers a thunderous hit check. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. And he sidesteps the check there. Oh, and he lines up his opponent perfectly with a hit check. Gets it over to Kotkaniemi. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Fires it on net. Oh, he steps up with the glove to stop that one. Here in the late goings of the period, Carolina's been the better team, and the scoreboard shows it. 4-1 is where we sit. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with first center scrummed up. There's the whistle. Let's get the call for the officials. In this game, you're always trying to buy time for your teammates, but sometimes if you hold on a little bit too long, you're going to get the interference call. out of the zone and that's a break for the squad oh uh, yeah this pk unit they're out there for a reason james you have to be able to clear the puck and it's easier said than done but they make no mistake this time broken up in the neutral zone by stall puck sent in and that will allow for a fresh group of forwards to get out on the ice carries it across the line carolina's penalty killers get a hold of it Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Here's a chance in front. And that's stopped. The Flyers will get some fresh legs out there as they continue this power play. Skates to the crease. Makes a save. Gets a piece of him with the glove. Stops him again. Ah, beauty save back there. He's really owning his crease. Sends it into the offensive zone. Handles the pass. Here's a shot. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. By flashing the leather on this save, the shooter's in a great A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. He tries to feed it over to Lawton. Here's a breakaway. Crowd on their feet. Oh, that just looked like indecisiveness there, Cheryl. Yeah, and a lack of confidence as well, James. When you're in all alone, you have to know exactly what you want to do and you have to play with authority the hurricanes penalty killers come up huge you get the nod to go out there on the power play and make a difference and you don't it's frustrating and it's a real momentum killer here's a chance to the middle can complete the pass can hang on to the puck after taking it off big time stop there steps inside the line cuts it on net how did he stop that one? Oh, what a save there james i mean that situational awareness at its finest knowing exactly where the threat is in that slow slot and taking all the space away final minute of regulation here and it should be it Shot, steps up with the block martinick stick handling in his own zone fires it off target taken along the wall by carrier He's one step ahead of the goaltender, feel tight to the post, and wraps it around, gets there first, and gets the goal. The goalie coaches work all the time with one screen or one player in front, James, and he's got to do a good job of finding this puck. I mean, it just keeps him clean. The Hurricane. 
teams probably don't want this game to end the way things have gone here. I know we're in period number three, but Cheryl, what a night. Yeah, it's been terrific right from puck drop, and they've been consistent throughout the game, and consistency is always the word that coaches talk about. And if they can finish this off with this nice lead, that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck leaves the zone. Scooped up along the wall by Rosovic. Can't get a hold of that pass. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Kotkaniemi. From the open ice, they gain the line. He's got a step. Scores! Another one. And listen to these fans now. Cheryl, they don't like it one bit. Oh, they don't like it, James. It is ugly inside the building. You couldn't get anything going on the ice. And even harder when your own fans are booing. The Flyers need to find a way to convert one here late as they trail in the third. The Hurricanes take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. And one last save. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. The Hurricanes seemed overmatched at times, but you know what? They capitalized on their opportunities when they got him, Cheryl. All comes from changing the angle of their shot with the opportunities that they did get, and it was tough for the goaltender to know exactly where it was going. They did a great job of finding the lane. Hope you had as much fun as we did here tonight, and we will see you the next time. At least we hope so. From all of us here at EA Sports, take care, everyone. And that'll do it for today's game. Your Hurricanes beat the Flyers 6-1. to one With Coach Hatkov being the first star of the game, only allowing one on 32 shots. Your Hurricanes played lights out, even though the Flyers were a little bit more physical. And played pretty well on the offensive end. Fetchnikov and Natchez both had two apiece, with Slavin and Carrier getting a goal apiece. Stahl and KK had two assists each, with Burns, Goss to spare, Jarvis, Orlov, Chatfield, and Martinuk recording one assist. Kochetkov stopping 31 of 32 for a 969 save percentage. Next episode, we'll be traveling to New Jersey to take on the Devils in a grudge match. So that'll do it for today's episode. And as always, let's go Canes.